Hi, I'm Charles DeMarco, and welcome back for another edition of Monday Moments. Our mission at New Life Solutions is to protect the unborn, share the gospel, and transform our communities one life at a time. And we do that through ministries that are focused on prevention, intervention, and restoration. Today being June 7th, our walk for life in terms of us accepting pledges moving forward comes to a close. Now you can always certainly go to our website and support our ministry, but our Walk for Life is coming to a close today. And as I reflect on this last month and, and how the Lord has provided through you, I just want to thank you again for coming alongside and standing with us in our ministry and standing for the sanctity of life and really embracing what we see in Scripture to be a voice for the voiceless and a defender for the defenseless. But what we do for the Walk for Life really helps support all that we do throughout our ministries in terms of the array of free services that are offered. And in our pregnancy centers, those are things such as sonograms, pregnancy tests, STI and STD testing and treatment, well woman care, discipleship classes, life skills classes. And as we carry on each and every day, you may in fact come across someone that has a need for our services. Sometimes we're asked, uh, oh, I'm in the middle of a, an unplanned pregnancy. Where do I go for help? Or I need help in this area. Where can I go? Well, we have four pregnancy centers right in the Tampa Bay area, a woman's place medical clinic. And everything that happens with the Walk for Life supports the free services that are offered that we just spoke of. So there are resources to help. Whether yourself or someone you know has a need, we are there for you to provide hope, compassion, love, and grace. And also, our Passages of Hope, Abortion, Grief, Recovery Ministry. This is a ministry that provides that hope and healing, and restoration and forgiveness. Forgiveness found in Christ. Because one in four women have walked through the pain of an abortion. And although not talked about a lot publicly, please know there are resources available to help those that are walking through this pain so that they in turn can use this as part of their testimony to help and minister to others like no one else can. And that's what also our Walk for Life goes to support. So I just wanted to share with you specifically how we're able to come alongside and help those that may be hurting and where hope is provided, where peace is restored, and where that restoration can begin. So thank you very much. God bless you.